Welcome back fellow adventurers to Outworth and the quick tips episode today will be that you're going to get your health back with a fair decent amount of loot if you wish to pick it up and there is combatant enemies so I would advise make sure you're yeah, equipped decently, decent weapon, some bandages, you'll need a health potion for this to do it guaranteed. Um, it can bug out sometimes and you don't need a health potion but it's required to get one, you can get one from the Appleton town. Now you want to go into the storage unit of the main area which is straight underneath your house but you have to go to the docks. I'm going to time flat this because it's me looting everything. I'm just going to loot everything because I want everything and I'm going to sell most of it to be honest if not all of it. Um, and you'll fight at least two troglodytes down here and about four or five hyenas on the way out. Uh, you can run past them completely, so make sure that you've got enough max stamina to run past them um, and some bandages to keep you going. I'd advise using the bandages before you encounter them, so you've got to be a healer of time. So, to the right down here, there is a troglodyte who I will fight now. Troglodytes are one of the creatures that drop oil as well, it's a good way of farming oil. Um, and uh, they also drop their their, their staffs sell for quite a bit so I'd advise picking them up if you can carry them and here's the second troglodyte down the way we have to go to go to the area to get the uh, the, the tribal favor uh, completely easy really cheap to get because obviously it costs you a health potion but you normally can pick them up if you're lucky if your orange is lucky so you want to go down here out there Onto the beach, straight down here. Watch out for the thunderbugs. I completely forgot what their traditional name is, but they will annihilate you this early on in the game if you don't have the right gear. So make sure you've got a health potion. Run over. Talk to this guy here. Give him a health potion. Open his mouth. Talk to him, talk to him, talk to him. And then, yep, yeah, he'll give you the tribal favor. Yada, 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 yada. It's all story stuff. You can sort this out yourself. And uh, see, it took one of my potions. So if you don't have it, it doesn't work. If you ever get lost in the wild and you're trying to look for the, thing, look for the lighthouse, it will tends to be the main beacon. You can see it from most high peaks. Okay, we want to go straight up here. And you just basically want to hug the left side of this mountain all the way up and all the way around. You will come across some hyenas. About two to three hyenas. Make sure you loot everything. There is a chest on the way up here as well, which you'll see in a minute. So you can loot everything. Remember, make shiv stuff, like make your shivs, hats, and stuff like that. Do not sell. So if you don't want to pick it up because you want to sell it, or you, you can deconstruct it and sell the raw materials, besides wood. If it's metal, you can make iron scraps, you can sell them. See, so some miners here. I'm a lot more powerful, and I've got better gear, so you won't be able to kill them this easily. If you do, congratulations, you're a lot more skilled player than I am. <clears throat> So you just want to run straight back to the main safe, but to the left here there is a, another chest here with just some traps and stuff in it. But it's completely ivory, so you can get ten times better stuff than I do. So you just want to run all the way back, keep to the left side of this mountain. Make sure you don't run all your stamina resources out, otherwise you'll knack yourself out before you can even get there. Just in case there's more hyenas in the way, especially early on in the game, there is a lot of hyenas until you wipe them out. So you just want to keep heading, keep an eye out for bandits and stuff because they just do wander around. So I, I would advise, you know, don't be stupid. Okay, now we're back in the town. We want to go and talk to the tribal leader. She'll be in her main mansion. This is completely after you start the tutorial, by the way. I completely forgot to mention that. I do apologize. So straight up here. Just double check if she's not in my house still. There we go, that's it. You want to go in. Don't forget to pick the axe up. Good bit of silver there. Chat to her. Tell her about the blood price. Say that you have the tribal favour. Yada yada yada. There'll be some more story stuff. You get your house back. Don't lose it means that you've got a free storage chest and stuff like that, which is great. Goodbyes to them. Okay, brilliant. Right. Hope you all enjoyed it, happy hunting, and uh, please like and subscribe and comment as you will.